And time for the DMV Soundcheck. This week, we are featuring Coco Man, who started singing in the Glee Club while he was in elementary school here in D.C. He later joined a group called Dimensions and eventually went solo. Coco Man left music for a while and then came back to help follow his love for Christ and music. Let's hear from Coco Man and also his single called Hurt, which is really about healing after tough times. Coco Man, thank you so much for joining us today. Um, I want to go back to the beginning of your musical career. Is it true that you started out in the Glee Club in elementary school? Is that where it all started? That's definitely true. I was <laughs> in the Glee Club in elementary school. <laughs> <laughs> and where have you grown from there? Like, what? I know you were in it several groups. You have a big following in what, London, England? How did that all happen? Well, that was with uh, the group main event. Uh, we were with the independent label at the time called Washington Hitmakers, and they were the push behind that. It had nothing to do with me per se uh, as, a, as a solo artist, but back then uh, we had a little bit of a push. And, you know, I think for some reason uh, they're really loyal, mm. uh, the loyal following with all kinds of music there in the UK. So, um, like this, this this album that we did way back in the 80s, early 90s is still available uh, in the wow. UK. Wow. I love that your journey has brought you to where you are today. It sounds like you've taken time to raise your sons, your two adoptive daughters, and uh, have a career, but now you're going back to write your solo career. What has this been like for you to bring music back into your life? I tell you, this, uh, this, this pandemic has, mm -hmm. uh, had some challenges and uh, you know we've lost a lot um, uh, there's some people who are no longer here with us mm -hmm. uh, during this journey and then there was the birth of something uh, something that I thought I left behind and, and that was get, <clears throat> getting back into the music mm -hmm. um, no matter what we do in life I, I believe wholeheartedly that if God puts plant something in you uh, it'll never go away so got back into the songwriting got back in the studio and I gotta tell you, it was like a rebirth mm. and it feels so good to uh, get back to something that I really, really enjoy and something that I'm really passionate about. That's so great. I, I also love you. you have a new single coming out, right? Um, it's called Hurt. What is this song about? Something personal for you? I think they're all personal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You know, uh, The Hurt is actually out, uh, that was released. I actually have four songs out at the moment, uh, okay. both on all different platforms, but Hurt was the first release in 2020. And um, it was a, a personal experience. It's really not about Hurt. I mean, the, the title may seem, uh, you know, uh, it could be inviting and, and could mean something different for someone else, but it's really about healing. It's really talking about uh, two people who have been hurt and uh, as we go through this hurt and this experience, this is, we, we admit that we've been hurt, so what do we do now? Mm. Let's move forward and let's grow and let's trust God on this, on this journey uh, to get back to you know, healthy uh, yeah. trust and, and, and love and living again. Yeah, is that where you hope this journey is gonna take you? Are you open to whatever is to come and you're just enjoying being back in music? Absolutely, absolutely. I, I definitely enjoy writing. Uh, there's so much to write about uh, these days, uh, just putting everything in perspective. And I, again, uh, being a, a God-fearing man, I, I believe and, and trust that, that God puts something in all of us. And uh, that's where my strength comes from. Yeah. And that's where I put the faith with. Some about that day when I first laid eyes on you. Wasn't supposed to be there. You weren't supposed to be there. Oh, but somehow I knew that you were gonna be mine. Uh, in the split of old joy, just the thought of you being my wife.
member of a band, group, or solo artist from the DMV and you're interested in being featured on our show, follow us on Instagram at DMVSoundCheck9 and send us a message with your work or email DMVSoundCheck at WUSA9.com. Be sure to include a link to your music video.